as you guys know, I'm a very big anti-Republican conservative viewer or a preacher. But there are some things that I completely understand. It's like maybe the uncomfortable feeling or the blah, blah, blah of cisgender people who are generally more right-leaning. But I want to go ahead and explain that most of that is in self def like defense of like their own children which i understand but that most foreign concepts like like trans the trans community most foreign concepts are scary because you don't understand them at first uh then you kind of look at the people who are successful in the trans community who aren't really assholes or really pushy about it and kind of just keep to themselves and I think that's beautiful. I think that's fine. They're not going to schools. They're not trying to tell your kids that it's okay to be trans. They're not trying to... When, when you have a, a five-year-old up to, like, uh, you know, even, even during their teens, all these kids, they like shiny things. They look at things they think are cool and blah, 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 and they want it. They want to suckle on it and eat it up and fucking... That's all they give a shit about. And if you let them do that and, and you don't sh show them first how to be, you don't show the boy how to be a man first, then you'll never know if he really wants to be a man or not. You, you, you don't show the girl how to be a woman as she grows up in, in age, then you never know if she really wants to be a woman or not. If you confuse them and, and say, oh yeah, you could be a boy, oh yeah, you could be a girl when they're a fucking kid, you're going to confuse the shit out of the kid. And especially if you make it a curriculum or you, you do it on a, on a, on a monthly or, or a, even just a yearly basis, it's it's going to confuse a kid. The uh, waving the gay pride flag in the schools is fine. I, that's okay. If, if you were just teaching like a basic like gay pride, fine. Tra trans? No. I, I'm, I'm for the trans community. You should do what you want. I, I, I don't think it is wrong if you want to be. People will use the argument, they say, uh, people were like, oh, you have a female brain sometimes in a male body. And I'm like, oh, okay, is that really how it is? But then lately, a lot of the arguing for it has been, well, the there is no female or male brain. So the brain actually doesn't follow the blueprint of the DNA of the body. So therefore, the brain can come up with whatever social construct it wants to be. So therefore, if you want to, your social construct to be a woman, but your blueprint of your DNA is you're a man, then that's how trans makes sense that way, which ultimately, ultimately makes it a choice. Now, if it is a choice, fine. That's, that's fine. If, if, if in the future my kids grow up and, and I teach them how to be, you know, a man teach them how to be a woman, if they decide, hey, dad, you know, I want to be a girl, I'm going to go, why? I'll, I, whatever, whatever answer they give me, I'm not going to give them shit. I'm not going to yell at them. I'm not going to be mad at them. It's fine. You know, if you want to actually genuinely be that and you, and, and you have a decent answer, a decent response, if you say, I really don't feel comfortable being like this, I feel more comfortable being like this because reasons and then you explain it cool with me dude like honestly don't give a shit that's fine you're an adult you can do what you want at that point and I'm, i don't want to criticize you for that i don't criticize anybody for that i think the trans community gets a lot of hate for for specifically what they do to kids at schools and um see when we talk about like drag is is supposed to be very very harmless i don't particularly find it interesting same reason i don't find halloween interesting i don't like dress up i don't even like da dating with women that have you know fucking makeup or all that shit it's just uh, anything that's that's not i can't wear anything that's not like a t-shirt and basketball shorts and i usually my 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 type of uh well i'm bisexual so my type of like partner or women or men that i'm into is it's the same get up you know basic you know lazy shit nice and comfortable because why would i want to dress up and all that i don't understand lingerie either it's just like all lacy and oh they're like oh it's sexy i'm like no you got all this fucking shit everywhere and like sent uh, maybe i have sensory issues i don't fucking know <laughs> but um that's part of the reason why i i don't that's the biggest reason why i don't like drag is because it's, it's a very personal issue it's not like a serious big thing but again i don't like the concept of confusing children i think confusing children is wrong teach them to grow up and to become what they are and then if they they want to consciously make a change to shift from one social gender to another 
and then they can learn a new gender. Don't make them learn two genders at the same time. There are so many different stages to becoming a man. In order to learn how to become a man, you have to learn that over the entire course of your adolescence. You cannot just learn what it means to be a man through, through elementary school. You have to go through middle school, through high school, even into college, and you have to learn incrementally how to become a man. The same for how to become a woman. You don't just learn how to become a woman when you're a fucking five-year-old. Okay, so that's why I don't like putting that stuff in, in schools because they have to develop and learn in order to say, hey, I want to be trans. That is my opinion of that. Now, for being gay, I think it's a little bit different because for being gay, if you go, okay, simple stuff. Randy has a crush on Bobby. Crush, you know, little kid stuff. Fucking, they want to hold hands. They want to hug. They should be able to do that without being called the F word or being criticized by Christians. Now, that's exactly why I think it's okay for gay pride and gay flags to be celebrated in schools. Because we're not celebrating a sex thing. It's, it's a, asexuality is not sexual. Asexuality is just like, I am into women and I am into men. I am interested into them. I'm, I'm attracted to both of them. I'm a bisexual. That is a sexual orientation. That is nothing to do with actual anything that is inappropriate. These are just scientific terms. Just because they have the word sex in them does not make them sexual. A lot of people will blow up and be like, Oh, you're raving at gay pride in school. It's fucking pedophilia. No, it's not. Shut the fuck up. And to be fair to the, you know, the cisgender people and the people who are generally upset about this stuff, I understand when they're running around gay pride parades and shit, running around with fucking giant dildos and all this fucking stupid shit, all this inappropriate stuff wearing leather, I hate that. I fucking hate that so much. It is so gross to me, especially when it's around kids. I cannot fucking stand that shit. Anything that's inappropriate Get it the fuck away from children. If you just have a fucking flag and you're going, we're celebrating the the historical, you know, fact that it's okay now for um, boy to like boy, girl to like girl, it, that's fine. That's, there's nothing wrong with that. Everything else, leave the kids alone. Honestly. Like, like leave the kid, let, let the kid fucking grow and develop incrementally in order to decide, okay, now I know what it really means to be a man, now that I'm fucking 27, now let's do something with that, maybe, or I don't know, I don't know, I think try, trying to put trans in, in drag into children's minds when they're very young, I do think that is confusing and damaging, they're trying to learn their fucking ABCs, they're trying to learn addition and subtraction, they don't know a goddamn thing, they're going to look at one shiny thing and jump on it and go, yeah, I want this. And they're not going to know what the fuck to do about it. So that's that's all I really wanted to talk about. Thank you, guys. Complete.